Hi there, it's Michael Ackerman coming to you from Seattle, Washington, where I sell real estate with Coldwell Banker Bain. Today I'd like to talk a little bit to all of you buyers out there that are starting to look for a home. And this is something that comes up a lot um, when I have my initial interview with buyers before we even start to go out and look. I explain the process, I explain that they really should get pre-approved for their loan in the first place. And more often than not, a line that you'll hear as an agent or a broker is, oh, financing won't be a problem. And most of the time, abs they're absolutely right. It's not a problem. What I'd like to talk to you a little bit about is the fact that financing for you probably won't be a problem, but the seller who you're going to be making an offer on their home doesn't know who you are and has no proof that financing is not going to be a problem. So it's very important for you to actually get pre-approved with a reputable lender so that your agent or broker, when they present your offer, can also present a pre-approval letter from a lender to show the seller that it's not going to be a problem. Finance has gotten a little bit tricky in the last couple of years. The uh, lending institutions, which used to be or used to have a lot wider guidelines, have really gotten a lot more strict. So a buyer who has a great credit score, good down payment, um, you know, good history with credit, used to be able to easily get a loan, and for a lot of them, you still can, but there's a lot more documentation and a lot more hoops to jump through nowadays. So when buyers say, oh, financing won't be a problem, it sometimes is a problem now. So for your own sake as a buyer, you will probably want to go through that step first. Talk to a lender, get pre-qualified, which means they can let you know based on your debt to income ratio how much you can afford, let them know how much you're comfortable affording. A lot of people don't want to max out you know, the amount that they could uh, qualify for. They just actually have a number that might be a little bit less than that. And then go ahead and send in all your paperwork and get approved for your loan. That way when you get that approval, you know there's not going to be any bumps, you know there's not going to be any um, you know, sideways movement at the last moment that's going to upset the apple cart and make the transaction much more stressful. If you have any other questions about financing or real estate in general, feel free to email me at Michael Ackerman at cbbain.com. And do remember, it's all about the connection.